Good morning, everybody. Good morning. I hope you guys are having a wonderful Tuesday morning. Uh, it's a late start today, okay? It's about 8.40 on Tuesday. And beautiful weather outside. It's raining outside. Uh, it's about, what, 70 degrees out there. It's raining. It's perfect weather, okay? Perfect weather for, you know what? Uh, let's make some Dalgona coffee. Uh, if you are new to the channel, welcome to our daily live streaming. Uh, let's see, I mean, we go live pretty much every morning and sometimes some days afternoon as well. And we just make coffees and talk about recipes and maybe product review perhaps. And like, like this morning, uh, we are going to make, uh, I don't know how many of you saw the game on Netflix. And the, the fact is I uh, came from Korea when I was in high school. So all those games you guys seen on school games, I played it uh, when I was growing up. So. Uh, this morning, I'm going to show you one of my favorite sugar candy, Daigona candy, or I think in this country, what we call honeycomb candy. And then when I was growing up, it, it was called Pocky as well. So it's great, great candy recipe. So easy, okay? Only thing you need is some sugar and some baking powder. That's uh, not baking powder, baking soda, okay? So we need some baking soda and some... Uh, uh, kind of like sugar, you can use the raw cane sugar, but the best sugar for that is just a plain white sugar. Okay, so I'm gonna be using uh, so I'm gonna be using about half cup or about 100 grams of sugar. Okay, 100 grams. It sounds like a lot, but it's not. It's not that bad. Okay, so you know let's get going here. Okay, let's get going. Let me show you so again that this is extremely easy, and also we're gonna going to make some. Uh, uh, Dalgona milk tea as well. We can use that as a milk tea too. Okay, so let's see here. We got uh, my I got my induction stove top ready. I'm gonna go to uh, high heat. Put the sugar in it. Okay, do not stir it, okay, until you're going to see everything start melting. Just wait. Meantime, I'm going to get my uh, baking soda ready here. Got my baking soda ready to go. As you can see, you can start things still melting now. So this is a good sign. Right, they're starting to melting. Again, this is really simple, easy. As you can see, it's starting to melting now, guys. The side over there. Man, you know, you have to smell this. Smell is wonderful. Starting to bubbling. Getting very close. The key is you don't want to burn it. So make sure it's starting to melting. I'm just going to stir, stir it. Man, smells wonderful. Nothing like burnt sugar. We are getting very close, okay. At this point here, I'm just gonna make sure that all the sugars are melt. And then, now we are going to add this baking soda, okay.
Maybe it's the SM baking soda here. That's it. And lift it. I'm just gonna toss it into my pan. So this is Dargona candy. Okay. And I'm gonna wait about a few minutes and then we're gonna have a delicious the candy. Once you get dry or cool down, it's gonna be amazing. Okay, it's gonna be amazing. All right. So we're gonna we are going to wait a little bit, okay. The fact is I love using the induction stove top. They're so easy to work with. I'm just going to put some water in my pan here. And you can easily clean up later as well. Okay. You can easily clean up later. I know when I was an, uh, when I was kid. So this is like burnt sugar water. If you drink this, actually they're quite tasty. Okay. So my Dalgona candy is pretty much cooled down nicely. You know what? Goodness, I think I, I think I overcooked it. Okay. Yeah, I think I overdid it. So it's not a. Yeah, I think I gotta try again. Hold on a second. Maybe not. Hold on. There we go. That's it. That'll work. Okay, that'll work. So this is a delicious candy. I think I slightly overcooked it, but I think it should be good. Yep. It should be good, man. They're so good. So uh, as you saw, I mean, the candy is very easy to make. Uh, I thought it was, uh, I thought I overdid it, but should be okay. You can actually lift out. So this is like, hold on, ho hopefully I can show you guys better. So this is Dalgona candy here. This is nice and hot still. Still chewy as well, but the ideal, you might wanna put like more baking soda. Should be better, but what you wanna do is later, once everything's cooled down, and you're gonna crumble it. And then, hold on a second here. Uh, and then crumble it and then uh, mix with, you know, you can make mix with some milk and some espresso and put the candy on the top. They're pretty good. And also you can uh, use it as kind of like milk tea. Uh, get some ice and some put some milk in it. Put some candy on the top as well. It's, so you're going to kind of like caramel flavor. It's, it's, they're fantastic. Okay. Fantastic. Let's see. Uh, what else? Uh, Jordan asking me, uh, at some point I'm going to... I'm gonna try that, okay? So, uh, so uh, last night, me and my younger son and I, we are playing one of those Dalgona games. I don't know. So, have you guys played before? If you guys are from Korea, this is the paper game, okay? I know you guys, you guys might saw it. So, this is my homemade, like, well, I made with the newspaper. I played with my son last night. So, it's, it's a lot of fun, okay? A lot of fun to play one of those older games. Okay, uh, let's see here. What else? Uh, this morning, I think uh, I showed you guys how to make the candy recipe. But the key is, you get you don't want to overcook it. Okay, so it sh if you are starting to um, start melting the uh, sugar, and then put the baking soda and then turn it quickly and stop. So now, I think I think this is good. This is fantastic. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to crumble everything here. I mean, look at this. 
put this one on your coffee a lot of sugar by the way it's a lot of sugar let's see it's a junshik mention if you're older than 30 then people will know and you know, again I mean because I mean I play this in 70s okay uh, this game 70s and 80s and I came here when I was 90 so uh, the fact is uh, my cousin uh, told me uh, the other day not a lot of kids in right now in Korea they don't play games anymore that mean mo most times they are studying so okay so what I'm gonna do is uh, you know what there's a very quick video this morning and then uh, uh, let's jump into Instagram uh, let's see here and then uh, let's I got some big surprise for you later today okay so I'm going to make some announcement on that as well on my Instagram live uh, I hope anyway I hope you guys like uh, this kind of video making recipes I think I'm planning on doing some more and then this weekend I'm ready to uh, actually we are uh, my wife's going to make uh, espresso bun cake okay espresso bun cake so so I'm uh, planning on making that video this weekend uh, espresso bun cake I don't know sounds great so we are going to pull the gray shot and then uh, and pretty much it uh, it was a quick session this morning and then let's jump into Instagram live uh, make sure you join us on Instagram as well you know just show us your coffee bar setup and then go from there all right I'll see you guys on Instagram